Okay, guys, AHS here. A TSU football player has been exposed. He had talent for putting crazy chicks. So, they, and, he's, and he's his old boy. You know he has talent for putting chick, crazy chick. If you're associated with this dude beyond this point, it's on you. It's on you. Your family can't blame nobody else. If you get caught up, it's a foolishness. It's a crazy chick do something to you. Hang around with this motherfucker. This dude is very talented. He's talented on the field, torn that rock. But he's also talented at pulling crazy chick. They say he banged one of staff members. And he tossed her ass to the side of the road. And she rammed her car into the motherfucker. So why are you tossing me to the side of the road? I'm very upset about that shit. This is the chick right here, Ariel Escobar. <laughs> this is funny, man. 2021 class. A woman's a woman summit for careers in football. It's a bad look, man. It, it, it confirms it confirms everything, man. Women should not be in football. Any woman in football, referee, coach, they need to be fired because of what that chick did. What's, what she did to that dude by ramming her car into the into the dude for cheating. <laughs> a TCU football staffer arrested for allegedly ramming running back running back car in jealous raid. Talk to femininity. And she's not even original with her shit, man. She's not even original. A whole bunch of millions of females did this shit, man. She's like no original, man. She didn't get new material, man. This is the uh, the lover boy right here. TSU, TSU. I, if I say TCU, excuse me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is the the crazy chick that he pulled. A Tennessee State University staffer was arrested earlier this month. So why now I'm hearing about this shit? Why now I'm hearing about this shit? After she allegedly rammed her vehicle into a Tigers player car in a fit of jealous rage. He tossed her ass to the side of the road and she was upset about that shit. So last some dreams. I love you, I love you, I love you. According to court record, Devon Starling, a TSU junior running back, called police at 2.30 a.m. on December 3rd. This dude having problems at 2.30 a.m.? Jesus, man. In Davidson County, Tennessee, as he said he saw his ex fling, Ariel Escobar, this is the chick he talked to the side of the road. He upgraded. He got a better white chick. The Tigers, director of football operation and campus recruiting. How the hell is she recruiting old class to Tennessee State? Ass, 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 ass. Yeah, my ass. It went bad. And they running back say, I gotta talk your ass to the side of the road because you have bad ass now. You told me when I come to Tennessee State University, you had good eyes. Now the act is spoiled. I got to talk to her at the side of the road. In her car, outside of his apartment, as he arrived home with his girlfriend. So she was out there stalking that motherfucker, man. She was outside stalking that motherfucker, man. Damn stalker, man. So ain't this guy that stalk. It's female that stalk, man. Look at her, man. Damn, she, damn, she like she could play the WNBA with that, that uh, manly face, man. She likes to play the WNBA, ain't no doubt about that shit, man. The football player who logged 540 rushing yard and two total touchdowns this season. And he didn't improve those numbers, he wasn't going to the NFL. Claim he told Escobar to leave, but she refused. Yeah, women, they don't take, they don't take direction uh, well from guys. Police say in document that Stalin then proceeded to drive around with his girlfriend. While waiting for cops to arrive. Oh shit, this dude set off, man. This dude set her off, man. This, this dude lucky he ain't dead, man. He lucky the chick had her beta shit. That gun. That gun is a beta shit, man. He lucky, man. Talking to that chick, man. <laughs> Try around with your new boo, your new white girlfriend. This is her mugshot, Ariel Escobar, crazy, crazy female. According to the docs, Stalin said that after pulling into a parking lot, Escobar followed him and then blocked block him into a spot. The Tigers tail back alleged she then rammed her vehicle into his car while he and his girlfriend were still in it. She was trying to mark her man. That's my man. That's the guy that I promised when he comes to Tennessee State. He'll get a lot of ass from me. And he broke that contract by tossing me to the side of the road. 
in the dog stalling said Escobar actually backed up and hit his car a second time before pulling off he claimed his car had minor damage see it was over right there it was over right then it was over right there but it was not over according to the doc Escobar later showed up back at his apartment you see he was talking that chick man he was talking that ass and she showed up to finish his ass off for good I'm surprised they ain't talking that with attempted murder man I'm surprised man uh, where she was arrested, police say she told them she did block them in with her car. She, she admitted being a crazy bitch and said she wanted started to confess to his new white girlfriend. This other chick, she got to work at, at uh, TSU too. This got to be another staffer, TSU staffer, man. This this guy, he got crazy chick pulling game. Confessed to his girlfriend that he had, he had a sexual relationship with her the day before. You believe that shit? I believe that shit, man. I believe that shit, man. This dude want to be ass player, man. Cops say the 22 year old also admitted to throwing ketchup and, and scratching, stalling a public door as well. Uh, damn, this is a cat fight, man. Why the hell he throw ketchup at that dude for, man? God damn, what, what, what's the uh, the meaning behind the ketchup, man? See, what he standing at me? That's a threat. Is that a cat? Is that a threat? Is that a threat? She'll kill him in the future. I don't get that. What he threw ketchup, man? But I know she, when she when she claw your door, she just marking her territory. Any other females, they know. When females see that, that claw mark, they know what it mean. They know what it mean. He's dealing with a crazy chick, or he was dealing with a crazy chick. And she might be back, so don't be around. Court record show Escobar has been charged with two front account of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Why is he not charged with attempted murder? And one count of misdemeanor vandalism. She's scheduled to appear in court in January. Sing it, sing it, sing it, sing it, do no jail time. They, they don't plead out. Sing, sing it, do no, sing it, do no, no jail time. Escobar is in her second year at TCU Director of Football Operation and on campus re recruiting. We know how she recruiting players to, uh, to TSU. We reached out to the school for an update on her status with the program, but so far, no word back. She gotta be fired. She has to be fired. She's over that dude. She's over him. She's over him. She gotta be fired, man. She has to be fired. He has to be fired. Yeah, but you guys, you got to pick wisely, man. And with friends, let's be careful around this dude, like I said. He has crazy chick pulling game. And before we close out, look at Neymar. Brazil is out of the World Cup. Soon as I seen two dudes on Brazil team with blonde hair, I said, these dudes, these dudes ain't going to win shit, man. Brazil, you need to cut tie with Neymar. You need to cut tie with the Neymar, man. He is bad luck, man. He's influencing the younger guys. They have blonde hair. The folks like the video, like, subscribe to my channel, and give me your opinion. Give me your opinion, man. Fill up the comment section with your opinion. Hey, HS here.